Morning, little Miss Crybaby. So, feeling any better after that nice long cry? Uh, I'm perfectly fine. Good. So, now what are you planning on doing? Yeah, now that you got your memories back and you saw what you wanted to see. It's obvious, isn't it? I'm sticking with you guys. Are you sure that's what you want? I. It's not like I'd just abandon you to fight the Autofagos without me. Besides, I've come this far. I want to see it through till the very end. Me with, like, almost any playthrough on this channel. Well, we're glad to have you, Patty. <laughs> I'm glad to be here. Um, there's a lot that I've been wanting to ask, but don't know how. Well, I know we're all dying of curiosity, but you tell us when you're ready. I, I'll tell you everything when the time is right. But... What? Oh no, it's an American Black Friday. Judy, what happened? Wait, that's where Osbio is. What's going on? What, and they can feel that earthquake from all the way over here? It's like the other side of the world, whatever. What? Is it like End's Castle coming out of the ground? It's like if you combine End's Castle and Dracula's Castle from Castlevania. Along with Pokemon's Super Mystery Dungeon, it's gonna go towards the sun. Oh, okay. Ospio, what happened to Ospio? What the hell is that thing? It looks like a mountain. Belay that, a building. Tarkaron. Huh? The spirits are telling me that's the tower of Tarkaron. Duke, it's gotta be him. He's going to try to use that against the Autophagos. Please, let me through! You, with the long black hair! Do you have a moment? What do you, do want? you have a moment to talk about our Lord and Savior Poseidon? Some people with the Knights wanted me to tell them if I saw someone with your appearance. They said they wanted to talk to you about Flynn, the new Commandant of the Imperial Knights. What? I believe you are the right person. Yeah. Hey, was it a girl with kind of cat-looking eyes and a kid with a head like an apple? Huh? Oh, yes, I suppose so. <sighs> so can I wait at the end? Yes, that's fine. I'll call them. Oh, okay. And really, Osprey was just the next town over? And just chills there in the sky. My friends in the location where you fight the final boss of the game. Oh, oh. Um, I guess we'll save here. Wait, and I need to do this. And I don't think so, ducks. Um, what, what's going on? Wait, what? It's locked. Do I just like chill in here or something? Maybe, I guess so. I don't like you, and I hate her freaking her even more. Yuri, Loa. She did the stabby stab. <sighs> Sodia? So what's up with Flynn? Oh, right. Many people have fled this continent since that monster covered the sky. But some opposed using a guild fleet to protect the Empire. Flynn could not abide that. A fleet attacked by monsters landed on Hypionia. We fought, but they kept gaining. We alone were sent for aid, but all the knights are spread all over the world. We have no other choice but to ask for your help. But we're too late. Commander Flynn must be... Wow, could you be any more worthless? What did you say? You give up already? Everything you've done, what was it all for? 
I... I did it all for Commander Flynn. Even that one time. <laughs> you talk about doing it all for Flynn. But you're just whining. You gave up. You forgot your resolve. Resolve? Yo, Applehead. You said hi, Peonia, right? Y yeah All right, I'll be back soon. All of you get ready to go to Tarkaron. I'm going to. Yeah, me too. You keep forgetting us. I'm glad you want to come, but this seems pretty bad. That's even more reason not to let you go alone. I don't think Baul will listen to you either. All for the guild and the guild for all, right? Well, if we're out of time, let's go and get it over with. I will follow you to the day I die, and with more moxie than a snapping moray eel. Okay, okay, so let's get going. Yeah! Brave Vesperia, charge! <laughs> go get him! All right, Sodia. Let's reform the support units. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't like them. <laughs> Can I actually rest up at the inn now? Let, let me test it out really quickly and stuff. Yeah, she's a freaking, she's a Flynn simp. Like, yeah, I can stay at the inn now. Let's just spend a night at the, at the inn. And yada yada. Welp. That's <laughs> an interesting idea there, Tux. Um, hold on. Now we'll save with the, uh, thing for Bob. It's what we'll do. Should I adjust the doogie cam? Should I adjust that? Boopity bop. Um, yeah, so I guess we're not- So where is this other place anyway? I straight up don't know. Do I need to restock on things after that one boss fight again? Do I maybe need to do that? Maybe, maybe? Cool, well, there's some- there's some things. Will it just tell me when we actually get out there? Whoa! I'm just now noticing with this game. When it comes to the movement, it's like, you know, I have a controller that has like open movement and whatnot across the stick, but it's like the movement, it still acts as if the, as yeah, if the controller yeah. has notches, if that makes sense. I was just what? now noticing there. Why didn't you call me out for my actions that time? I, I tried to kill you. Oh, I'm not letting it go, but I don't have time to deal with someone who gave up on everything. I haven't given up. No? So why haven't you gone to help Flynn, even alone? You wanted to protect him so badly you'd kill me! Why won't you protect him now? I... I can't protect him by myself. Please, save him. Please. You don't have to tell me to do that. Please. You know, there's one thing I agree with you on. Hmm? I'm a criminal. I could be killed anytime. Flynn is the perfect knight, a perfect leader. He doesn't need a criminal by his side. Uh, I'm just standing in until the right person comes along. Yuri. Hmm. What a seems to put set of cutscenes we had there. He's always that way. He doesn't mind getting hurt if it means protecting others. Yeah, he gets a little crazy sometimes. Like you're any different. Birds of a feather, right? I'd say we're all like that. Like what? We all stuck with brave Vesperia, even when the going got rough. <laughs> I guess none of us can just let things go. Right, so we can't just let Flynn go either. Yeah, exactly. Well, since we can't let it go, I think it's time we get a little crazy. Get crazy! Let's go! We're getting crazy now. So fly to the northeast corner of the middle? Wait, of the middle, southernmost continent. So, southernmost continent. See, will automatically start when you draw near. So, northeast corner of the... So, here-ish? Okay, cool. Is that it down there? That's some cloud of dust! Are those all monsters? This seems to be a counter-effect of Astal's losing control. It's as if the monsters of the world all came and gathered here. Is Flynn really down there somewhere? Probably. What next? We're gonna fight every single one of them? 
Fine by me. Just give us two days and we'll beat them all. Probably. Two? You can't be serious! Rita, can't we use that Dane Nomos you made? You gonna blow them away like doing it to the Atafagos? Right. Applying directivity to the power of spirits and forming a barrier-like force field to eliminate the monsters... Yes, it should be possible. But this was made to be used against the Atafagos, right? But this is our only option now. To use it now or wait till later? This is quite the conundrum. Why can't you do both? Could you let us use it, please? It's, is it not possible to do both? And this is a perfect test run. Thank you too. The Dane Nomos. I want to believe it can save mankind. Yes, if we can't deal with this easily, there is no way we could stand up against the Atafagos. All right, let's do it. And what was Patty's whole comment about? Like, hmm, do we use it now or do we use it later? It's not even a decision. It's rare to hear Yuri ask for a favor like that. It's not even a decision. You can do both. She made it sound like you could only do one or the other. It's our chance to do Yuri a favor. Cut it out, guys. So what's our plan? Activate it in the area where the monsters are all concentrated. That's it. Simple, right? Yeah, it is. No kidding. Why don't we give it a name? We can't just call it the Rita de Nomos. Huh? I'll leave it up to you. Uh, hmm. Uh, I got it. How about the Vesperia number one? I should have known better. It's got a nice ring to it. Besides, it's nice and simple. Even Baul will need to keep some distance. I'll land further away. Okay, let's do it. Vesperia number one times one. The key to victory against Atafagos, the ultimate weapon of brave Vesperia. Okay. What a mess. We're going in. Look, over there. Flynn! Hey, looks like he could use some help. <laughs> the monster was like in front of him and he was behind the monster and they were facing the wrong directions. Uh, it seemed I can't like. see anything. We should hurry. No need for caution, just charge right in. Let's go. Stay close. Uh, we have this support right Don't now. Are you kidding me? Is this really the time for this? They are the great pirate symbols. When they are united, they'll open the gates to paradise. Are you paradise? kidding me? This is really the time to have this conversation. You really are an airhead. There are dozens of tales of paradise from all ages and all over the world, and none of them are true. But adventurers are people who turn legends into reality, right? So what's this paradise like? Who knows? Where is it located? Don't know. Is there anything you do know? Mystery is part of the romance. It's like your magical research, Rita. My research gives clear-cut answers. Don't compare it to your fairy tales. Patty, it's you. This is really the time to, to have this conversation. This is really the time to have this conversation. What the hell is going on here? Also, <laughs> Guzma, out of thin air is a figure of speech. Um, it doesn't mean actually made out of air. <laughs> let me, let me just say. So Flynn was over here somewhere. Like that. That's literally just a figure of speech. Is the thing. So I guess we'll. Uh, I have no idea where. Oh, okay. D <laughs> I don't know why I found it. It's in my whack. I say we are done for. This is the end. You idiots, stop your whining. Damn. Damn. What is that sound? Not the explosion, but like the tossing sound. You alive? Yuri, what are you doing here? 
Thank your second in command for thinking of you. Sodia? Huh. But our current situation's bad. It's only a matter of time until we fall. We have a little special something. What? <laughs> what? This thing up in the middle of the monsters? And then watch it go boom! In the middle of the monsters, there are a lot to get through. Come on, it's us. This is nothing. <laughs> All right, let's go. Hey, we're gonna go turn this thing on. Keep things going here. Just you two? Are you stupid? We cannot let our guard down here. If we can't defend this place, we lose the very reason for taking out the monsters. This isn't to defeat the monsters. This is to protect the people. That's right. Understood. Leave it to us. We'll do everything we can. Much obliged. Take care, you two. Harder with everyone. Flynn joined the party. Okay. Just in case Let's you go. didn't know. What? Wait, is Repeat coming along too? I guess so. That means we didn't quite part with everyone. Okay. Welp. Learned immediately. Divine streak. Whoa, he just reused freaking solar beam. That is what he did. My goodness, Welp. Do some damn ow. You are mean. You are real mean. I'm glad the repeats coming along, but you're learning another thing. Holy lat. There's a there's a hey, lot of dudes here. To get worked up. I am not worked up. <laughs> it's okay. Don't hide it. Would you be serious for once? I am serious. <laughs> Maybe I should have been paying attention to the uh oh come on. Time. Well, conversation. Concentrate without talking, so oh my goodness, they're completely stop. surrounding him. They're completely surrounding him over there. I don't think we're taking a whole lot of damage considering this being as scripted as it is. It doesn't want you to lose this. I don't think. Like, it doesn't seem like we take a whole lot of damage, is at least the impression that I'm getting. Okay, I'm glad that I gave, like, repeat new things. It might not matter, because this seems like a thing that- Is Flynn even taking damage? Has he taken any damage this whole time? It's continuing to do more and more monsters. Is the thing. Gonna use an orange gel on repeat? Welp, I mean, uh... What the hell are you? The hell are you? It's like a weird version of the blooper boss from Mario Sunshine is what it kind of is Kind of makes me think of in a way. Hey, hey ow Let's try our other thing for Bob. Let's try our other like Whoops that okay. That was not at all necessary. You have a tornado now. You now have a tornado apparently Welp. Boop lots of damage. Ow Yeah, they don't do a lot of damage at least which is, ow, come on. Ow, you're mean. You missed your solar beam. You missed your solar beam, man. How dare, stab. Stab with the shenanigans. My goodness, at least more fast paced than if it's a turn based thing. Yeah, this this game here is a what, real time based game. Is it, ow, 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 you are mean. How about you don't? Freaking get. Over here, get on down to Funky Town. How about, why don't you? I can barely see things happening here right now. We have our limit thing all the way up. I guess we'll save it here for now. Okay, so Flynn has taken some damage, but like not a massive ton. It doesn't seem like poozin bottle. I've been poozened. Why do I keep getting poozened? The dudo just disappeared. I guess he was defeated. I guess is what's happened. Stop. I hate how I like can't smack them on the ground, but it's like sometimes I can and it's like weird and inconsistent and strange Are these like I was about to say are these the last few few enemies, but they're not There's a lot more Dudos where that came from it seems a hey, stab Stab freaking the Lorantises are here to screw whoa this dude despawned and then he like respawned immediately the hell The hell you're giving me an orange gel is that- that's from my own inventory, isn't it, right? Dang it. I was like, what if Flynn just had, like, his own little pocket of gels? That would be cool. That would have been neat. Instead of going through, like, my own inventory. That means we're gonna have to restock again! Gosh darn it! Man. 
but I guess we gotta do what we gotta do. Well, thanks for the thing, the little pick me up with the apple jail. Boop. Oh, so that restores a bunch of HP while you're in it, it seems like. Yeah, you are freaking big and mean and whatnot. You are waving your hands around like you just don't care. <laughs> okay, is this the last dudo now? But yeah, um... Yeah, that would normally be an option in this, but like, it doesn't really seem like you can dodge things all that well. Like, I can schmoo, but like, the cooldown on um, me doing attack is so long that I'm never gonna dodge anything anyway. Like, bam, that's where I can move after doing an attack, for example. Or if I did my regular string, that's when I can move. So like, you're not really gonna be dodging a whole lot in this game. I mean, there's a block button, but it's the same cooldown on the block as it is the, uh, you know, the regular schmoovin', so. I don't exactly get to avoid a whole lot of attacks in this per se, you know. You're not too bad either. <laughs> well, I got a lot of stuff apparently. New skill, new title, a lot of new stuff. We're about to the middle. I'm still up for some more fighting. <laughs> you look like you're actually having fun in the middle of all this. <laughs> you do too. <laughs> Now, Yuri! Right. Take this! What is this music right now? Oh. It's becoming something more grand. At first, that was like the most out of place thing. You're being sent to a slightly shittier dimension. should be okay for now thank you so much <laughs> you think if i was injured i'd probably be on like the ground or something like that but no i'm just like standing here chilling don't push yourself okay vesperia number one broke huh i'm sorry yeah seems like the materials we used to make the body were too brittle it was our fault don't worry the core is fine and i can repair it it's just what a sad ending. <laughs> that is not at all what the text says. Estelle has saved their lives, but they shouldn't move for a while. <laughs> a sad end? Was that even a line that was supposed to be played in this cutscene? Was that a glitch? Did the wrong voice line play at this moment or something? Did they not play test this? I guess we have to stay and defend them for a little more. They did not play test this, did they? So why not just make this a fort? It's been a while, Yuri. I've heard stories about brave Vesperia. I guess the mercenaries I hired weren't sufficient. Sorry for the trouble. I'm sure the guilds are in chaos right now, too. Thank you for your help. It won't really make up for things, but I'll help with the defense. You're going to fight? Oh, no, I'm a merchant. Just watch. Commander Flynn, you're alive! Witcher, is something wrong? Yes. That tower near Ospio has created an unusual formula around itself. Judging by the crests, it's absorbing some the kind of The formula is something like A squared plus B squared equals C squared. In addition, all residents throughout Alikia have reported feeling strange. <laughs> That's just a regular day. Absorbing? Feeling strange? Is it absorbing human life? Duke. Life is very pure mana. Does he intend to use it to attack? This is what he meant by exchanging all human life to destroy the Atafagos. The formula is expanding in stages. At this rate, it could affect the entire world. No! We can't just stand around. But the spirit's power alone won't be enough. Even if we repair Vesperia number one, that alone won't be enough. What? But it took out all those monsters! Judging by the size of the Autophagos, we'd need several hundred times the power. Several hundred? That's going to be tough. Facing this calamity is going to take an insane amount of power. I guess we have no choice but to change the cores to spirits. Wait, could you explain what you're talking about? Oh yeah, we meant to talk to you all about it. Hey Flynn, we want to tell Yoder and the guilds too. Can you call them here? <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, Yuri. You seriously want him to call the Emperor to a place like this? You never change. I could say the same for you, Yuri. What? <laughs> okay, I'll see what I can do. In exchange, you all go talk to the people of the Union in Palastrale. Okay. So I guess we're off to Dongrest and Nordopolica? Yeah. Mind giving us a ride? Oh, okay. Flynn left the party right out with everyone. Oh, okay. Um... Oh yeah, if you're not strong enough, that's why we gotta learn the Avatar State. Exactly. Part you is scared to hear a full review of this game once you beat it. Feel like you're gonna butcher it so hard. Could be wrong, but it's we'll see. We'll see here. I don't know what you what you know or what you're thinking right now, but I'm sure his highness would agree too. Yeah, yeah. Was that tower bit by me? So what am I doing? Uh there's a savey book. There's a savey book here, so I mean, uh... I mean... Hey, look, it's those guys. It's those guys. So, okay, Yuri, a thing happens. Thank you. For, um, saving... Flynn. <sighs> you guys go on ahead first. I'll catch up. I'm not gonna tell anyone. Why? Because I can understand why you try to kill me back there. There's something you just want to protect, even if it means dirtying your own hands. You lose your senses in the heat of the moment and find yourself doing things you'd never imagine. I know what I have done is unforgivable. It would have been easier if you'd blame me for this. Don't flatter yourself. Don't think I'm here doing this for your own good. I'm not going to put the blame on you just so you can ease your conscience. W what? What should I do? I have no intention of lecturing you about rights and wrongs. Go figure it out yourself. Oh. If you can't, go ask someone you can talk to about this. But not me. As Flynn's friend, I'm grateful for the loyalty you've shown towards him. Hmm, well, what have we here? Yuri's not too fond of young Sodia, is he? I can see where he's coming from, though. Everything about her feels hard as a rock. That's not exactly easy to like. Ah, cut her some slack. Knights are all a little square. She has a stubborn nature that quick to act folks like you and Yuri don't. And that's a good thing. Stubborn is good? You totally lost me there. I figured I would. That's why we can't talk without getting on each other's nerves. Yeah, I do think interactions like that are not like that support, not like that party chat, the cutscenes just before, are very intriguing parts about this game. So we're going to, where are we going? Nordopolica and another place. Gosh darn it, I've forgotten. Is this one of them? I don't remember, let's check. So we're going to like two places, does the order matter? Not that. It was Nordopolica and something else, I think. I did- Wait, what? A cutscene's happening? Did I do a- Oh. You might be able to stop by the cap- Gosh darn, is this a side quest thing? The capital? Are there people left in the lower corridor you'd like to see? There's not anyone I absolutely have to go and see, but okay. What? But- No. We're not. Um, go to Dongrest. Was that the guild place? Uh, where- is that, huh? I think it was over here somewhere. I think. It wasn't that, it, but this one, right? I think? I think it's this? Yeah, Dongrest, okay. Ow. Okay, there's no immediate cutscene on getting into Dongrest. No immediate, do I need heals? I guess so. <laughs> I do need heals, so. I guess I'll do that just with the Yuri. So, boobity bop. Yes, we're staying the night. We're staying the night. We're already here. But, hey, look. Want to become famous? By... For, well, we already did this freaking thing. Was the thing. My goodness. Well, Guzma banned the bot. Hey. Well, you startled me, aren't you? Harry, right? Harry Potter. I appreciate the bit there, Super Hyper. Practicing your last time, too. 
Yeah, I always have trouble sleeping whenever I come back to the city because of the dawn. Yeah, I want to be strong like he was. Every time I think of what he did, I feel like I have to work harder. Well, to <laughs> me to cheer while I appreciate the bit anyway. I can borrow this. What's this? It's a sword that the Don used to off himself. It's heavy. It feels heavier than it looks. Yeah, so all the responsibility of holding the guild together is contained in that sword. Yeah. I'll let you use it whenever you're practicing here. It should make for better training than you've had in the past. I can use this sword? Just lending it to you, though. You have to give it back in the morning. I still need to work on mastering it myself. I see. Thank you. Welp. Don sword. All right, then. <laughs> okay, so it's not even something that gets to be kept. Maybe if we go to the inn, like, one more time, he gets to keep it the next time. I don't know. I don't know. So let's see here. No, not slot 99. Not slot 99. My goodness gracious. So... We go all the way to the top here, right? Do I need to stock up on things? Gosh darn it, I do again, don't I? Let's go do that. Let's go do that really quickly here before I forget, you know. Come on, yeah, store number one, yada yada, all that stuff. Freaking. I wish there was just like a fill up all consumables thing for Bob, but I mean. Go to the Don's chambers, will do. Okie dokie, Dr. Jones. I shall make my way on over there. Is what I must do. Running, 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 running. I've got places to be. Anyway, as I was saying earlier, like this controller, like it's a control stick with open movement, but it still seems kind of like it has notches in a way. I don't know. It's weird. So you got yourself a lot, buddy. Yeah. The freaking sorts us out for situations like that. Easy peasy, you know? Don's chamber a thing gonna happen. So are you telling me to go all the way out to the countryside? I wonder if this place is any good. This place is no good, and Zaphius won't work either. We gotta make these things fair for everyone. This is something important. For the Empire and for the guilds. Hmm. I'm not going to be used like some messenger. I don't want to leave Dongrest at a time like this. It's up to you, Harry. All right, I guess I'll be going. What? This is important! You're just gonna decide like that? It's all right. I'm not gonna question Harry's decision back there. Hmm. That settles it. We'll be back at the Little Prince's earliest convenience. Okay. Oh, all right. All right. Well... So now what are we doing? Check. It looks in the pot, your face is turning red. So wait. Did I do what I needed to there? And now I go back into the world and the other place that we go to is Nordopolica? That was the one with the Coliseum, right? I think. That's like in the southwest. I think. Um. I did everything I needed to here, right? I hope. Did I do the things that I needed to over here? What is that massive chain thing in the distance anyway? Like, I strip don't know. A thing with a blast here. Um, so we're going to Nordopolica. So we're going down this way. I never even mapped out the whole world of this game. I feel like that should automatically be mapped out. In my humble opinion. There's like a whole continent here where we like literally never did anything. Isn't that crazy? Like a whole continent where freaking nothing happened through the entire game. <laughs> Welp. Yes, we go this way. Yes, we go this way. And then we land. Land down here and then hop on in. Is there gonna be immediate cutscene? Hi. This was just an immediate cutscene on coming into here. We'll wait here until Unlike the other place where there could have been an immediate cutscene, but there wasn't. Yes, thank you. That Nat sure is a man of understanding. We got his approval really fast. He's seen the world change before his very eyes. He doesn't have an ounce of suspicion when it comes to others. I wonder if the Union and the Polistrale can get along. Of course they can. They're of the same guild, after all. That's right. 
Now is the time to put their differences aside and join forces. They'll have to get along. I quarreling only aids you in understanding one another and forges true friendships. We'll be their bridge over troubled waters. You're right. There's still that little prince. Let's go back to where Flynn and the others are. Maybe they've made some progress. Yeah, let's head back first. Gosh dang it, I gotta remember where that is. The Don's absence is still hanging heavily here. The atmosphere is a bit off, I think. Hmm. Yeah, I guess so. But still, they're not doing half bad. You think so? Sure, they may not show it much though. These guys prefer keeping their distance. Stand firm, don't fight, watch out for each other, help each other out. Not too close, not too far. I'd say they're doing just fine. So they don't just simply get along. Men are so complicated. Their hearts are like labyrinths. Men aren't the only ones. <laughs> Welp. Yeah, mean mapping out. Could be something I'd do before beating the game, but why would I do that? Why would I do that? It's like Greenland, nothing happens there unless we're in the post game. Do you want some freaking wacky about Greenland? There's the place called Greenland, and you look at it, and it's a freaking land of ice. And there's a place called Iceland, and you look at it, and it's a land of green. How does that make sense? Ever think about that? I think it was over here, right? Fairly certain. Ever think about how oh, that makes no sense? Okay, so I'm fairly certain it's here, right? Or the freaky town of... Wait, what? I'm supposed to be going there? I thought I was going here. 